Hello everyone. In this video, we will solve a few sums on interior and exterior angles of polygons. The first sum. Find the measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon of 9 sides. So given is Polygon has 9 sides. So, what is the formula for exterior angle? So, measure of exterior angle is equal to Three sixty degrees divided by number of sides. Now, in this case, number of sides are nine. Three sixty divided by nine is equal to forty degrees. So, the measure of each exterior angle in this case is forty degrees. Let's solve the second one. How many sides does a regular polygon have if the measure of an exterior angle is twenty four degrees? So, given here is. This is a regular polygon. So, the formula for major of exterior angle is. So, therefore, 24 is equal to 360 upon number of sides. So, we will move this number of sides on this side and this 24 on this side. Here it is divided by. So, when it goes here, it goes multiplied by. So, number of sides goes on the upper side is equal to this 24 is when it comes here it goes divided by and so 24 ones are 24 12 remains so 120 24 fives are 15 so therefore 15 sides the next one how many sides does a regular polygon have if each of its interior angles is 165 degree? So, if interior angle is 165 degree, then what is an exterior angle? Is equal to 180 minus interior angle, which is 165 here. Because interior angle and exterior angle, they form a linear pair. So, it is 15 degrees and number of sides are equal to 360 divided by the exterior angle which is equal to 360 divided by 15 that is equal to 40. So, number of sides of this polygon are going to be 40. What is the minimum interior angle possible for a regular polygon? And why? So, what is the smallest polygon we can have? We can have is three sides. Because we cannot form a close figure of two sides. And hence, the smallest polygon we have is three sides. So, now if it is a three sided polygon, so what is the exterior angle for that? So, the exterior angle will be 120 and therefore, the interior angle would be 180 minus the exterior angle. And therefore, the smallest interior angle possible for a regular polygon is 60 degrees. And the largest exterior angle possible for a regular polygon is 120 degrees. So, let us do this. What is the exterior angle of a regular polygon whose sum of interior angles is 720 degrees? So, given is seven hundred and twenty degrees is the sum of interior angles. Now, what is the relation between sum of interior angles and number of sides? One eighty multiplied by n minus 2 where n is number of sides. So, we will write here 720 it is given is equal to 180 multiplied by n minus 2. Now, this 180 goes that side multiplication becomes division and therefore, now this minus 2 goes that side and hence it becomes 4 plus 2 is equal to n 
and therefore n is equal to 6. So, number of sides are 6. Now, once we get number of sides, we can find the exterior angle. So, measure of exterior angle is equal to 360 divided by number of sides. That is equal to 360 divided by 6, which is equal to 60 degrees. So, how did we do? We knew the sum of interior angles. From the sum of interior angles, we found out the number of sides because we have a relation between sum of interior angles and the number of sides. And once we get number of sides, we can find the major of exterior angle by doing 360 divided by number of sides. The next one. What is the sum of interior angles of a regular polygon if the major of its exterior angle is 72 degrees? So, given is We know the formula. So, we know major of exterior angle is 72 degrees. And therefore, this number of sides goes that side, 72 comes this side. So, the number of sides what we got is 5. Now, we know the relation between number of sides and sum of interior angles. So, sum of interior angles is equal to 180 multiplied by n minus 2, where n is number of sides. So, that is equal to 180 multiplied by 5 minus 2, which is 180 multiplied by 3, and that gives us 500 and 40 degrees. So, sum of interior angles in this case is 540 degrees. We have so many other videos in this topic understanding quadrilateral. I am sure they will provide you much more insight into this topic. So, don't forget to watch those videos and also subscribe our channel and click on the bell icon that will ensure that you get notifications whenever we upload new videos.